All you need to know ahead of the 68th NBA All-Star Weekend in Charlotte. Basketball fans are now just days away from the 68th edition of the NBA All-Star Game. Charlotte plays host to Team Lebron vs Team Giannis at the Spectrum Center but there is plenty planned before the two stars of the sport lead out their drafted squads to cap off a packed weekend of action. Sports Mail brings you everything you need to know about the All-Star Weekend from musicians taking to the court on Friday, a dunk contest on Saturday on before the main event on Sunday night. All-Star Celebrity Game, 7 p.m. EST. Dash the All-Star Long Weekend kicks off in style at Charlotte's 8,600 capacity Bojangles Coliseum. NBA legends, WNBA stars, actors and musicians are teaming up for the curtain-raising All-Star Celebrity Game. Of the names set to play, 58-year-old Dr. Oz will be involved for the home side while Stephanie Dolson of the Washington Mystics and the WBNA forms part of a formidable opposition, coached by Sue Bird the first pick in the 2002 WBNA draft. Home team Terrence J. Rap City Chris Daughtry Bo Reinhardt Dr. Oz Mike Coulter Famous Lost J.B. Smooth Steve Smith Aja Wilson J. Williams Jason Weinman Coach, Don Staley Away Team Aja Buckley Mark Larry Amanda Seals Quavo Adam Ray Brad Williams Ronnie 2K Bad Bunny Hussan Nhaj Stephanie Dolson Ray Allen James Shaw Jr. Coach, Sue Bird Rising Stars Challenge, 9 p.m. EST. After the initial hoopla of the celebrity game is done and dusted at the Bojangles Coliseum, all eyes turn to the sport's brightest young stars on the show court at the Spectrum Center. For the fifth year in a row, a team made up of up-and-coming American players, those in their rookie year or second season, will face their counterparts from around the world. Luke Doncic, who narrowly fell short in voting for an all-star spot, is the star name as he leads a world side crammed full of talented players. Jason Tatum of the Boston Celtics and Kyle Kuzma of the Los Angeles Lakers help form the more recognizable names in the American ranks. Skills Contest Dash aptly dubbed the All-Star Saturday, events kick off with a test of a player's skill set. A field of eight, four front court, four back court players, will go head to head in a three times rounds. Each section's winner will then battle it out for the title in one final round. The obstacle course facing the entrance in order, ball handling, passing, layup, dunk, three-pointer. Mike Conley of the Memphis Grizzlies is the favorite, narrowly edging out Doncic. Dunk Contest Dash This is the premier event of Saturday's action. Four of the NBA's top stars, Charlotte Hornets Miles Bridges, Atlanta's John Collins, Oklahoma City Thunders Hamadou Diallo and New York Knicks Dennis Smith Jr. go against each other in the dunk contest. Each competitor gets two dunks and the two players with the highest combined score from the two efforts will progress to the championship round. The final two players will each complete a further two dunks with the player with the highest score crowned champion. Judges will determine the scores with the lowest available 60 and the highest a clean 100. Three point contest dash 10 of basketball's best shooters, including Golden State Warriors star Stephen Curry and defending champion Devin Booker, will take to the court for the two round competition. Each player will get 60 seconds to shoot and make as many of the 25 allocated balls as he can. In round one, nine shooters take the court in a random order, while defending champion Booker will shoot last. Then, the top three from the opening round will compete in what is known as the championship round, with the lowest round one scorer going first and highest going last. If tied, tiebreakers will decide the 2019 champion. NBA All-Star Game, 8 p.m. ET, dash as it was last year, the two squads were selected on the draft system with team captains LeBron James and Gianna Santacampo in charge of the picks after earning the most votes. Basketball fans joked when the squads were revealed that LeBron is treating the All-Star Game as a scouting mission to bolster the LA Lakers ranks with those soon-to-be free agents. Five of LeBron's first six picks, Kevin Durant, Kerry Irving, Kali Leonard, Anthony Davis and Clay Thompson, are able to hit the free agent or trade market in the summer. The league's coaches unanimously made the selections for the 14 reserve players. Team James Starters, Kevin Durant, Warriors, Kerry Irving, Celtics, Kali Leonard, Raptors, 
James Harden, Rockets, Reserves, Anthony Davis, Pelicans, Clay Thompson, Warriors, Ben Simmons, 76ers, Damian Lillard, Trail Blazers, La Marcus Aldridge, Spurs, Carl Anthony Towns, Timberwolves, Bradley Beal, Wizards, Commissioner Adam Silver's picks, Dwayne Wade, Heat, Team and to Count Post Starters, Stephen Curry, Warriors, Joel Embiid, 76ers, Paul George, Thunder, Kemba Walker, Hornets, Reserves, Chris Middleton, Bucks, Nikola Jokic, Nuggets, Blake Griffin, Pistons, Russell Westbrook, Thunder, D'Angelo Russell, Nets, Nikola Vucevic, Magic, Kyle Lowry, Raptors, Commissioner Adam Silver's picks, Dirk Nowitzki, Mavericks, Spectrum Center, Charlotte Dash the home of the Charlotte Hornets, a franchise owned by NBA icon Michael Jordan, will soon be clad head to toe in signage for the All Star contest. Everything from the graphics on the playing floor to TV production areas are being tweaked with the game closing in. Reports in the U.S. say that between tweaks to the arena, TV production setups, and other production elements, 500 to 700 people have worked on Spectrum Center specific preparations for All Star Weekend. All the changes come at a cost to the capacity, however. The arena's 19,000 capacity will be reduced by around 20%, about 3,800 seats, to accommodate for the various All Star editions.